Hi everyone, this is Mohammed from Better Cloud. Today I wanted to look at a popular workflow we've set up for a few customers, and it's automating the provisioning of a new hire across Namely, G Suite, and Slack. Let's get started. As we come into Better Cloud, let's go ahead and create a new workflow for whenever a new account executive is hired into a company. We'll start with Namely. We're looking for any time a user is created that matches a specific title, and in this case, that title being account executive. Now when an account executive is created in Namely, we want to kick off a sequence of events with the first one being a creation of a Google user. We're going to build into the process that Google pulls the information that was provided from Namely to populate the appropriate values. So we're going to pull the first name from Namely and the last name. And for email, for example, if you're following a first dot last name, we can do the same thing here. First name, we'll add the dot and then pull in the last name and then populate it with the appropriate domain. We'll go ahead and add a default password and ensure that we require our users to have a password change on their next sign-in. The next part of this sequence will be to place this user into the appropriate org unit. So we're going to move the user to org unit, we're going to target the user that was just created, and we'll find the org unit that we want to place them in, and in this case being sales. Next, let's go ahead and create this user in Slack. So we'll select the Create User option. And since we have multiple instances of Slack, we'll choose the right instance. Now from a username perspective, our format is firstname.lastname. So we'll select the first name again from Namely. We'll put the dot in there and add the last name. Email, we'll go ahead and pull the email from the Gmail user that we created. And for a title, we'll go back to Namely as well. Populate the first name. And last name. And the last part of this sequence is we're going to go ahead and ensure that this user is added to the appropriate channel, and in this case being the sales channel. We're going to target the user and then find the appropriate channel, which is sales.